Hello, and welcome to Tax App Professionals video on customizing your preparation account. My name is Jake Etheridge. I'm the senior UX designer uh, for Tax App Professional, and I'm going to show you how easy it is to really customize Tax App Professional to make it what you want it to be. So first and foremost, what I'm going to do is I'm actually here on my client manager page, and I'm going to go up here to preparer uh, in this file menu, and I'm going to hit master information. And from here, I can see a list of options, and I'm going to hit practice. So this is going to allow me to make some adjustments to my practice overall. As you can see here, uh, this is the master information that's used across the board in Tax App Professional. This has things like your practice name. Uh, it has things like your address. And this information will actually be fed into applicable forms further in the process uh, of Tax App Professional when you're making um, returns and things like that. You can also see here, next up, I can add, edit, delete to preparers. Uh, so I can actually go in here and I can add preparers. We have a separate video on that. And I can make adjustments based on their permissions if I so choose. Um, I will let you know, though, that anytime you do have one of your preparers log in, they need to be using their unique Tax Act username and password. Um, so as you can see here, you can go in and do a specific settings for things like the preparer info, their e-file info, their permissions, et cetera. I can also go over here to my client return status and client pay status screen. So this allows me to add new statuses to utilize in my client manager. We understand that everyone look, works a little bit differently. You may have certain words that you like to use and certain ways you like to track uh, your returns and your pay status. And so here is where you get the chance to actually do that by inputting uh, those things um, and then having it here. And then you can make edits. You can get rid of statuses. And the same is true for the pay status. You can also see here your directory. This allows you to have the default locations where things are saved, et cetera, within the program. And then here you have more of this general uh, preparer master information, things like your filing and print options, and also some kind of like miscellaneous material here. It's good to go in here and see if there's anything that you would like to tweak to your needs. Closing out of there though, looking at my client manager in general, uh, there are some areas that I can actually uh, make some adjustments to my dashboard. So I can go to preferences here. And once I do that, as you can see, I have these tabs up here between my client manager, my appointment manager, and these miscellaneous items. If I want to, I can reset all the defaults and go back to the way that Tax App Professional is out of the box. Or I can go down here and I can actually choose what columns I want to be displayed in my client manager. So over here on the left are the, client, the columns not displaying things in here. And then over here are things displaying. And you can simply click items and choose to move them over. And then they will be moved over and you'll be able to see them in your dashboard and I can hit save and exit and it will save those items. I can also go up here to the preferences and I'm going to hit the appointment manager. And if you utilize the appointment manager within Tax App Professional, this is where you can uh, make specific preference changes to things like the color, the event color, the birthday color, start times, end times, etc. And then over in this miscellaneous section is where you're going to see some specifically uh, tweaking kind of the minute details of the client manager uh, and other aspects of the program, such as display sizes, return destinations, and kind of how that uh, Forms Explorer looks with showing the real-time alerts, et cetera. So definitely feel free to go in here and poke around and see if there are any settings that you would like to change. And there you have it. That's how easy it is to customize Tax App Professional to fit you and your practice. If you have any questions, please direct them to Tax App Professional Support. Thank you.